The question, what do you recommend using for acne? I've never used Proactive myself, so I can't tell you if it's any good. But there are major rules when it comes to skincare, so you can get rid of all your acne and keep your skin looking young for years. Cleanse with a natural oil, your skin needs the moisture to heal and an oil is the only thing that is gentle enough for your skin, that can actually clean your pores out. I'd recommend coconut oil. A double cleanse, cleansing once won't do much if you've been wearing SPF or makeup. You need to cleanse first to get rid of the product and then cleanse again to get rid of the buildup in your pores. For me, I prefer to triple cleanse as my makeup sits deep in my skin. Exfoliate slash tone in one step. Exfoliating scrubs or any products with beads, sugar, salt or kernels are far too harsh for your skin and cause micro tears on the surface, leading to milia, flesh colored bumps on your face. By exfoliating, toning in the same step. You avoid damaging your skin and are only getting rid of dead skin cells in a gentle way. Repeat this step after cleansing, daily. I'd recommend Pixie Glow Tonic. Hydrate slash tone in one step. After you exfoliate slash tone, you need to hydrate slash tone. Hydrating your skin helps it heal and locks in everything that you've already put onto your skin. For this, I'd recommend rose water. Moisturize. Like I said before, moisturizing is so important. Dry skin is going to produce more oils to make up for the dryness, which will only clog your pores as you go about your day and you will end up with acne. Oily skin will produce less oil as it will no longer make up for moisture loss, same as dry skin. This helps your skin heal, look young, keep elasticity and protect it from bacteria and dirt in the air. The best one is anything that is water-based or even aloe vera gel. Use topical solutions. For stubborn blemishes, I'd apply either my favorite acne treatment or a natural solution of tea tree oil and coconut oil. I would do this just before moisturizing and apply it only to the acne. Avoid mineral oil and lanolin. These two ingredients form a film over your skin and stop your pores from being able to breathe. It will clog up your skin and encourage acne, so make sure you never use a product containing these. Don't use shea butter on your face. Shea butter is too thick for the skin on your face and acts similar to mineral oil and lanolin. It's great for the skin on your body, though. Everything here is what I've learned from dermatologists and my own experience from when I was struggling with acne. Mine started at a very young age and I tried a ton of cosmetics as an attempt to fix it, but after years and years, these steps were my solution. I hope it helps you too. Tell me how it goes. D.